Hey, Tony. It's Thursday. And first off, to answer your question of the week, it's going. Um, we're fully moving in this week. Oh. We hope. Well, I mean, the big plan is to have our big move day on Saturday. And that'll basically be everything from as much as all the big stuff from the apartment and a good portion of the little stuff. And then it's just the long, long process of unpacking and getting getting the last from the apartment here. I'm not going to show the house yet because, oh boy, is it still a disaster because we're still working on it. Um, but it's going well. I've been having issues with the mower the past couple days. Josh already killed our mower. Okay, I didn't kill the mower. Um, so we got a we got a free mower from uh, Jay's parents, and well, you know it was going great, kind of. Well, yesterday it didn't start at all because it got a uh, got gummed up with um with some of the old fuel in it because it had been there for a long time. So we got that fixed up today. Uh, Joey came by and got that all fixed up, and I started mowing today. I got probably about three quarters through the yard in which uh, I was mowing in behind. Technically, it was not our property, but it's state property. And quite frankly, like the state's not going to the state's not going to take care of it. So it's pretty much by all intents and purposes, our yard, <laughs> a part of our yard. So I was uh, mowing around there, you know, good, good three quarters of, of the yard. And there was a uh, basically an invisible string that wrapped up all around the uh, all around the uh, the blade. Uh, I got it. I got that all cleared up, but it still it still stopped the uh, the mower in its tracks. Uh, I couldn't even I couldn't even pull the pull string. Um, my plan is basically that uh, tomorrow when I get off work, come straight here, finish up mowing. Like it'll take me probably a little bit of move uh, maneuvering and doing things like that to kind of like get the bit, last bit out, and then I can get just the then I can get the last quarter the last like I said probably a quarter or so of the yard. Uh, you. Know, Stuff I mowed looked pretty good. Uh, it's gonna be it's gonna be a long process of getting the yard to where I want it to be, because it's not a very high quality yard right now. But that's one of my plans for the long run is to kind of get that all set up. Um, but it's mostly just been it's a lot of moving things around. Like we have our mudroom hallway, which basically leads from our from our driveway into the house, is just full and i mean full of boxes but we're just kind of uh we're getting that done uh we have uh justice got his room all made up the other day which is pretty cool uh we haven't we haven't gotten the uh the master bedroom set up yet um nor have we gotten the uh, nursery set up that's cur it's currently the piggy room right now but that's probably going to change here in the next few weeks or so but it's just it's just a lot of work We've we've been here, so I think so. I get off work usually at like you know five ish, five thirty ish. I've usually been going to the apartment to grab a handful of boxes and coming here and uh, working on the house. I don't think I think there's only been like two days since we closed on the house on the third that I haven't been here till at least ten p.m. And tonight is probably going to be something similar. To that. Like this video is not even going to get uploaded until I get back to the apartment today. But it. We don't have yeah, we we don't we're not gonna have internet here until Saturday, but that'll be nice. Uh, we got we got a lot of hands who are helping us out on Saturday, which is good. Um, so that's that's the goal. We're, we got a twenty foot truck, which is more than enough, but it's all they had. I I thought we could have used a seventeen, but and I think that I think that would have been good, but unfortunately, like U Haul was just didn't have any seventeens available, so we end up getting a twenty, which is fine. I can drive those; those are pretty easy to drive as well. <laughs> And I just kind of laughed to myself in which uh, that's absolutely going to take all of our big stuff that, that we have still remaining. And that's going to be Saturday. I don't know how long we have the truck for because it was uh, Jay's dad set that up because he had the time today while we were all at work. And uh, otherwise, just kind of going from there. Um, <clears throat> the yard's going to need a lot of work. Uh, most of us, the house itself is in really good shape. Uh, there's very minimal we have to do. Like we uh, we're painting. We painted uh, Justice's room upstairs. Um, we have an accent wall in the master, and I ended up uh, Taylor and I combined basically. I did most of it. Ended up uh, doing a. Uh, we have a little back storage area in the basement 
that we ended up uh, putting down kills primer on, <clears throat> and that stuff is that stuff's brutal. Um, it's mold, it's mold killing, but um, you have to you have to wear a mask while you're doing it. So I ended up having to go to the store and getting like a uh, like a thirty dollar painter's mask because it's it's just it's a basement storage room basically, so it's really easy to get to just box yourself in with, with the smell. So I had to get a I had to get at least a decent quality mask and it worked out great. Like we were doing like 20 to 30 minute intervals of going through uh I said we we got it we got, I, I got the first coat fully on. Taylor went over a couple of the uh small a couple of the areas that need a little bit more today or yesterday after and uh painted the uh the accent wall in the in the bedroom. Um otherwise I'll end, I'll end up showing the full I'll end up showing the full house off when I have w probably next week or if not next week then the week after just because by that point we should have basically everything all all set up and in its place where it needs to be <coughs> but oh ownership is a it's an adventure <clears throat> it, it's an expensive adventure because you know there's so much you got to do I mean I, I can't even tell you how much money we've spent in the past the past like since we closed on the third and getting everything set up and getting like, you know, paints that we need, um, furniture that we need, beds and shelves and tables and things like that. A giant fucking mattress. Yeah, a giant mattress. <laughs> oh, right. <clears throat> but it's just like, it's expensive and I know it's going to stay expensive, but otherwise it's been great. It's nice to have a home. And I am really excited for Saturday night when I can sleep. I can sleep here for the. I can. I can finally sleep here for a night. Jay and Taylor are probably going to be staying here tonight because we we moved the guinea pigs over today. So they're probably going to be staying. They're probably going to be staying tonight, and I'm going to be. Uh, I'll end up uh, going to back to the apartment, and then I uh, ha have a couple of jail visits tomorrow morning. So after the jail visits, I'm going to go to the office for a couple hours. I'll probably leave the office at five and just come straight here and. Uh, my goal is to finish up mowing because most of the yard is pretty okay. We have one back corner that has really high grass that I was getting to here soon until the mower stopped working. But the areas that I mowed look nice, look nice, nice and neat. So it's just going to be a, a matter of getting it completed. Uh, so Tony, my question for you is how's work going? Because it seems like that's all you do. Tony, I'll see you on Wednesday? I'll see you whenever. See you then, Tony. Bye.